Here's an AMI This Week shortcut with Grant Hardy. Prolific inventor John Pimlott is passionate about getting everyone out on the water, including people with disabilities. His latest invention, the Rowcat, is an accessible rowboat designed to give everyone the opportunity of rowing independently. I was able to install the, uh, the center deck system, which is kind of the, the key feature, is that the, the center rails span from the stern to the bow of the boat just about, allowing for very easy transition for individuals of different situations to access the center rowing position of the, of the boat. I was able to basically install a basic electric trolling motor and the throttle protrudes close to where you'll be rowing from so you simply reach over and choose one or five on your, on your throttle setting and you have direct access to adjusting the power or turning off the power as you're enjoying your rowing stroke. Since the Rowcat can be driven manually through the electric assist or both, it works for rowers regardless of their ability. Hey, Rob's floating. Lift. It's a heavy, it's a heavy row, but that's why they got power boats, right? Exactly. Ah, this is beautiful. Robert Anaka, who has multiple sclerosis, typically sticks to pathways that are accessible with his walker. He loves the experience of being out on the water. Out on, on John's boat, the experience was phenomenal. Uh, it was, uh, it, I'm of course tentative with the leg weakness that I've got. And it's so stable, so smooth, and so easy. So easy to go faster than I thought with a couple of oars. So it was, yeah, it's one of the best highlights of my life over the last few years to be able to get out and have that freedom. You, you had no barriers there. There was nothing stopping you from moving left, right, or forward, or backward. I'm just going to uh, move the hull. That's it, Grant's floating. All right. There's no turning back now. <laughs> Personally, I loved the experience of rowing in John's accessible row cat with guided directions from John. Okay, both oars right now. Okay, do the right oar, just a right oar, just a couple of strokes. The stroke was smooth and relaxing and the boat's stability meant that I didn't have to worry about anything else. For Robert, John's work opens up a world of opportunities. When you have a disability, you can, you can end up sitting on your couch, listening to music, watching TV, or just staring at a wall, and you really start feeling, well, you can start feeling sorry for yourself. I know, I've, I've been through that, and it, 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 as soon as you get to that freedom to step outside and do something you haven't done since maybe you were 15 years old, 10 years old, or 20 years old, whatever it might be, just opens up, opens your eyes and opens up your heart. It, it really did open my eyes to that next step. And I myself, like I say, as I fight with my own issues, this was just a huge, a huge barrier that I never ever thought. I never thought I would be rowing on a lake, ever. I mean, it just was not in the cards. Now it is. 